Now, a major development in Sydney will create hundreds of jobs and boost the economy amid the coronavirus pandemic. Charlotte Mortlock joins us live now from the Sydney fish markets. Charlotte, exactly how many people will benefit from this development? Well, Annalise, the new project will employ around 700 construction workers while it's underway. And then once the new Blackwattle Bay precinct is finished in 2024, there'll be around 700 ongoing jobs at the Sydney fish market. So it's a pretty exciting development. It's now been given the go-ahead and the uh, green light really has proven that this will continue to be world-class seafood provided across not only Sydney but also broader New South Wales and also be a major tourism hub and attraction for those that might be visiting from interstate or overseas. The New South Wales Minister for Planning, Rob Stokes, says that this development was approved under the accelerated program that has been initiated by the state government to try and keep jobs and the economy going. The planning system acceleration program to date has now seen 33 major projects approved since the, uh, since the beginning of May. Uh, over that time, we've seen almost 23,000 new jobs enabled. Uh, that works out at about 18 jobs every hour. We know the need to secure existing jobs as well as to provide more and more jobs uh, to power our way out of pandemic. We're going to unleash the jewel that is Sydney Harbour on the world stage and build the best fish market anywhere in the world. Right now, this market has over 3 million visits a year. We want to double that over the next decade. The new precinct will have fishmongers, cafes, restaurants and bars. And it won't only be Sydney siders that benefit from this development. This is a project which is, yes, Sydney-based, uh, but it will provide support right through regional New South Wales, up and down the coast in uh, fishing towns and communities all the way up and down the coast here in New South Wales. This will provide incredible support for that industry. This is the largest investment in the fishing industry in Australia's history. Currently, the fish market attracts around 3 million visitors every year. Early works on the new site will commence in the next eight weeks.